Hey guys, looks like it's another shitty day here in paradise, sitting by the Caribbean, under a palapa or in the shade, chilling out. Looks like it's time to review a beer. How about another American adjunct lager? <laughs> yeah! Hola, Brotube, soy yo, DJ, tu gran amigo y anfitrión de DJs Brotube. That's right, guys. I'm back again. Another shitty day in paradise. Look where I am. You're not here. It sucks to be you. I'm gonna have, oh, another adjunct lager. And I figured I'll have this one. This is a hollow ass, pretty much tasteless beer. But if I ha maybe if I have it in its, I know, natural setting or native conditions, if I have Sol desde 1899 for 114 years, that's right, they've been making great beer, they said. And on their sign on the road, they said they're obsessed with quality. So let's see, we're not even going to put this in the glass because, you know, one, it's pish yellow colored. Two, it has a fluffy white head that dissipates quickly. No alcohol eggs, none of that uh, nice crack open. Aroma, it smells like corn and sweetness. And a really, really, really tiny, almost infinitesimal amount of floral hops, and that's it. So let's get a taste on this bad boy, see what's going down. This is 4.5% ABV, I think, yes. And it's 12 IBUs, if I remember, from Cerveceria Guacamotecmo Tezumo, or CCM, out of, uh, where is it, uh, Monterrey, Nuevo León, Mexico. Yum. Yep, that's how you drink this beer. You chug it, and then you belch, and you say, wow, that's completely tasteless. It tastes like corn and sweetness. There's no hops. But out here on the beach, somehow it works. I don't know. I can see why you put lime in this, because it actually will give it flavor. Maybe a little salt would do the same, but this is a great beer for um, beer cocktails, and, and that's about it. Um, it's good for the beach though. It's in a can. That's a plus. Can't have glass out here on the beach. So I'm sure if I looked at Rape Beer and uh, Beer Advocate, Rape Beer is probably grading this like a 5 or a 12, and Beer Advocate is probably giving it like a 69 or a 70. But does that really matter, guys? Right now it doesn't matter. But what am I going to grade? You want to know how this adjunct lager tastes in my palate? Well, I'm going to give it a C. Plus. It's not a horrible beer. Um, it's basically a chugger like this. And that's what you do with a beer like that. You chug it, maybe put it in a beer bong, and you belch. So C plus for me, if you're down in Mexico, you'll find this. I believe this is probably the most popular Mexican beer, or one of them. Until the next time, thanks a million for watching. And you gotta remember to think globally, and drink locally, and maybe not support the macro beer movement. Until the next time, guys, thanks a lot again, and that's a big peace out.